Hi, I'm Bias Hazard. I'm old enough to have been into computers way before it was cool. So what I wanted to do today is just sort of show you around a Linux system real quick. Uh, I've been wanting to do some tutorial videos for a while. I'm kind of stuck in bed a lot of the time, so I just sort of play with my computer. Anyway, this is Lucy. She runs Linux Mint. Mint is... Well, I really like Mint. I feel like that'll make me lose some leet points there, but no, it really is good if you're just starting to use Linux, because as you can see the desktop here is really similar to Windows. So here you've got your menu. You can see the programs that are installed. And here's your internet. I like Opera. Uh, you can use Firefox or Chrome too. And it's fine with images. We can go watch videos on YouTube. Down here we've got a system updater. It says my system is up to date. And there's a program repository here. So you can browse. just install those with an install button and then here is our package repository and packages are pieces of code that let your system work with various applications so we can see the ones that are installed just on my system and we can have a look at the system settings There's my system info here. Then uh, over here, this is an app image. So we can set it here to run as a program. And this is my video editor. And I'll show you some more from this later. Now this is where it starts getting really different from Windows. This is the terminal. Uh, basically, this lets you talk directly to your computer. So, I'm going to ask Lucy to go look for and install updates. Uh, sudo is a super user direct operation, which is saying that I'm talking directly to the computer. So now I'll get her to remove uh, outdated and broken packages. So now we'll update again. Okay, now I'm going to install a program. I'm going to put Krita on here. So first I'm going to get Lucy to look for any packages she needs to run it. 
looks like we're good. So I can tell her to go find and install it from the repository. Yes. programs and we can see Krita is here under the graphics tab so we can pin that to the panel here and there we go these here are tarballs uh, they're files that you can use to build a program uh, we'll get into that a little more later I think that's pretty much it for now. Um, remember to like and subscribe for more videos. If you'd like to make a call, please hang up and try again. If you need help, hang up and then dial your operator.